Hey, you, think fast. Here comes the gold team, Michael and Anne Marie. Here comes the blue team, Justin and Becky. They're here to play Think Fast, the game where fast minds and fast feet add up to fast prizes. And here's the host of Think Fast, Michael Carrington. Thank you. Thank you, James. Hi, everyone, and let's welcome today's teams. On the gold team, we have Michael and Anne-Marie. And let's say hello to Justin and Becky. And we'll be talking with you guys a little bit later on, but right now, here's how we play Think Fast. Our two teams will compete in a variety of mind-twisting, body-buckling events. Each time you win, you pick up 50 bucks for your team and a chance to solve our Think Fast Brain Bender for $200. Score the most cash, and you're going back there to the locker room, our one-minute matchup game for big prizes. Everybody ready? Then let's play our first event. Look who's here. It's Mrs. Worry. How are you today, Mrs. Worry? Oh, I'm sort of worry today, Mr. Carrington. I read in the Gazette that Frankfurters were on sale over at Johnson's supermarket, you know, the food barrel. 16 for a dollar. Mm. And, uh, I, but I'm just worried because if they're on sale, everyone's going to be at the supermarket. And it's going to be really crowded in the parking lot, and I won't be able to find a parking space, which means that I'll have to come home and take the bus instead. Oh, and I'll have to wear my floppy red hat to cover my face because I can never remember the name of the bus driver. <gasps> but I can't wear that hat because it's at the cleaners. Oh, that makes me worry. Oh, Mrs. Worry is very worried today. Now, I hope you were paying very close attention because I'm going to ask you what Mrs. Worry was worried about. I'm going to ask you a few questions now. This is the first question. Where are the Frankfurters on sale? Gold. At, um, where is it? Um, Johnson's Market? Yeah, at Johnson's Market, yeah. Here's the next question. How did Mrs. Worry know they were on sale? Gold. From the newspaper? No, no, not close enough. Blue? From the Gazette. Yeah, from the Gazette. Yeah. Here's the next question. Why would Mrs. Worry have to take the bus? Gold. Because her car, um, she couldn't find a parking spot in the parking lot. That's right, yeah. Here's the next question. Now, why does Mrs. Worry have to cover her face? Blue. The bus driver. You can't remember the bus driver's name. Yeah, that's right. It's two of these. First one to win, uh, get three wins, right? Okay. Whoever gets this next one is going to pick up fifty dollars. Where is her floppy hat? Go at the cleaners. Yes. Come on over here. Come on over here. Very good. Very good. You picked up $50 and a chance to take a look at today's Think Fast Brain Bender. For $200, we're going to show you a photograph of a common object. If you can tell me what it is, you'll get $200. Ready? Here's the first clue. Hmm. What is it? Sky. Sky. The gold team thinks it's sky. Is it sky? No, but that's all right. You didn't lose any money on that one, and we're going to see the brain bender after each event. But right now, the gold is leading with 50. Blue's still waiting to get on the board. So let's talk to our wonderful gold team here. This is Anne-Marie and Michael. How you doing? Hi. Good. They're very good. <laughs> Anne-Marie, why don't you come this way so we can see your lovely face? I understand you love dancing, and you want to go into cosmetology, huh? Yeah. What kind of uh, beauty school or things do you like to do? Well, I like to do people's hair, do people's makeup, and I want to open my own shop. Hey, well, I'm going to need that later on. You know, my do needs to be done. Of course, I don't wear makeup. I'm naturally beautiful, but maybe we'll talk about that later. And Michael once saved his brother's life from drowning in a pond. How did you do that? Well, he was falling in the pond, so I just jumped in and grabbed him. Well, there you go. That's how you save people's lives. It's that easy sometimes. And let's say hello to our blue team today, Justin and Becky. Come on over here, you guys. I understand Justin is uh, 
interested in politics and journalism. Yeah. yeah. Well, how's that going? <laughs> Fine. Good. I also understand you're doing an amazing trick. Let's take a look at this trick you do, Justin. Get, get this. I can um, just balance on my toes. For hey, that. let's see it. Let's see this. So cool. Very good. There you go. <laughs> and that will come in very handy in politics later on. Those guys are always balancing the budget, even stranger ways. And Becky has two huge Irish wolfhounds. How huge are they? They're taller than me, actually. Whoa, those and my are parents. big. And your parents. So do they they must eat a lot, huh? Uh, yeah, they do. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. Let's say congratulations to both teams and good luck. We're gonna go on to our next event. <laughs> All right, we have here we have two raw eggs and one hard boiled egg. Which one is the hard boiled egg, chicken? That one is the hard-boiled egg. So keep your eyes on that egg. I'm going to ask you some chicken questions, and when you know the answer, buzz in, and you'll have to identify that hard-boiled egg. Now, the, the way you'll identify that hard-boiled egg is to crack it on top of your head. If you're right, nothing to happen. But if you're wrong, you'll have some goop streaming down your face, okay? So here's the first question. How long do chicken eggs take to incubate, take to hatch? Yeah, go. 14 days. Well, hold on a second. It's, is it 21 days, 41 days, or 61 days? Blue. Blue? 21. Yeah, it is 21 days. Come on over here. You get a chance to pick which egg is hard-boiled. Just blue this time. Mm -hmm. Any idea which one it is? Pick one and smack it on top of your head. She thinks it's the middle one. Is it? Uh, is it? Yeah, yeah it is. Sort of soft boil, but yeah, that was the hard boil one. All right, that's one point for blue. Go back around again. We've got some more questions to answer. Find another hard boiled egg, chicken. All right, he's going to get another hard boiled egg while we listen to our next question. Ready? Which of these is not part of a chicken? Is it the wing, the legs, the lips, or the breast? Go. Lips. Lips. Chicken don't have lips. <laughs> so come on down here. And Maria's going <laughs> Maria's gonna take her chances here. Which one is a hard-boiled egg? No help from the audience. Smack it on there. Let's see what happens. Oh no! That means Blue picks up another point for that one, and Anne Marie gets awful messy. So let's move on to our next pick. Another raw, uh, hard-boiled egg there. Uh oh, or another raw one actually. The hard-boiled one must still be up there. Here's another question. Is the drumstick of a chicken white meat or dark meat? Gold. White meat? No, it's dark meat. So come on out here, Blue. You get a chance this time to pick the boiled egg. Becky's going to give it a try. Which one is it, Becky? Pick quickly in. Give it a smack. Oh! Okay, <laughs> that means Anne-Marie picks up another point. And uh, we're going to ask one more question. Put another egg up there, chicken. Let's see. The world record for eating chickens at one sitting is how many chickens? Five, 18, or 27? Gold. 27? Yeah, it is 27. Boy, some guy was some pig. Come on down, you get another shot. See, uh, she's a little wary about picking it this time. Let's see, which one is it? She's going for the one on the end. Give it a smack. Oh, no, that means blue wins. Yes, you picked up a point for that one. Very good. <laughs> Come on over here. That means you get another shot at today's thing fast. No, you don't have to pick the eggs anymore, luckily. <laughs> you won that one. You picked up another $50. And we're going to take a look at today's thing fast brain bender. Remember, it's a common object. If you can tell me what it is, you'll pick up $200. Ready? Here's another clue. Any guesses? A cloud. Becky thinks it's a cloud. Is it a cloud? No, that's okay, though, because the score is now blue 50, gold 50, and that means we're going on to our next event. Anne Marie, come with me this way. Becky, we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> this next event is called the Feelies. Ooh. And you might imagine why these things are here, because we're going to feel. We're going to hand things to your partner here, who has these gloves on and blindfolded, and he'll have to decide what they are. 
If you can identify the most in 30 seconds, then you'll win. And then we'll bring the blue team out and they'll have to do the same thing. Ready? You can pass them anything you want to pass them. Let's put 30 seconds on the clock. Go! Think fast. What is it? Roller skate. Roller skate, yes. A uh, hammer. Hammer, that's two. What's that? Rubber snake. Rubber snake, yes. What is that? A skeleton. Yeah, a skeleton. What's that? Tennis racket. Tennis racket. Uh, sh shoot. No, they're not gonna, no, no. You wanna feel it some more? Okay. Um, trucks, covers? Yeah, Converse, what a feeling on this guy. He, 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 <laughs> very good, how we with that all together? Six. All right, we're gonna bring the blue team out now, and if they can get six or, or, or more in 30 seconds, then uh, we'll have a contest. Let's bring them on out here. Let's bring out Justin and Becky. Oh my goodness, he's going all over the place. He has no idea where he is. Who am I, where am I? Okay, <laughs> the object of this game Becky is, you're going to pass your partner these objects. He'll have to feel them. The person or a team that can feel the most in 30 seconds wins. Ready? Go! What is that? A shoe. What kind of shoe? A uh, Converse. Yeah, Converse. <laughs> What's that? Tennis racket. Tennis racket, yeah. What's that? Um, pass. Pass. Next. Get those hands out. There you go. What is that? Um, a thing that you put... Um, a cylinder, um, I don't know what it's called. Okay. Yeah. What's that? A snake? Yeah, a snake. Say it out loud when you know it. Here are some of the great prizes today's winners can bring home from a trip to the locker room. Go stir crazy. This stir crazy popcorn popper from West Bend is famous for its motorized stirring rod that rotates the heated kernels so nearly all pop. Take your music with you with Lasonic's portable AM-FM stereo radio cassette recorder featuring auto-reverse and 30 watts of music power from Lasonic. From Bushnell, Bushnell Science Series. Educational products for children. Star Watchers decoder set and telescope with easy-to-read, self-teaching illustrated manuals. Learning made fun by Bushnell. Now, if you think you have to help around the house, where do you see this event? Michael? Thank you, James. Hi, and welcome back to Think Fast. The score is now gold 100, blue 50, but now each event is worth $100, so it could be anybody's game. Now, it looks like your parents have gone out. This is your house, and your parents have left you, and they've left me in charge. They even left me a note of what we're going to do while they're gone. And you have to listen very carefully because you have to do this in order. That's right. Ready? This is what they told me to tell you. First, we want you to take the plates over there and bowls and stack them. Plate, bowl, plate, bowl. You got that? Yeah. Then, when you're done with that, take the milk from the cat's dish. See it down there? And pour it back into the milk carton. That's what you do next. Then, we want you to take the jello here and put the jello in the pretzel bowl and the pretzels in the jello bowl. And when you're done with that, your parents told me to tell you to take this birdcage and put it in the television set. I have no idea why they said that, but they're your parents. Don't ask me. You got that? Yeah. yeah. Okay, now whichever team can do that in the less, least amount of time wins. Ready? Think fast. They're off. Stack those no, bowls. <laughs> Set it up again, set it up, hurry. Hurry up, set it up. Go, there you go, there you go. All right, all right, that's, that's, all right, that's good enough. Yeah, yeah, let that go. There goes the milk. Whoa, the cat's milk back in. Well, boy, your cat's gonna be upset. Whoa, what a mess. Okay, guys, let's get this cleaned up. But in the meantime, let's see what the score is. So far, the blue team wasn't able to get any of them, so that means if the gold team could get just one, they'll take this event. The gold is leading with 100 to blue's 50, and let's bring in the gold team right now. Come on in. Yeah. Well. The blue team didn't do it too well, you know what I'm saying? So you guys are in good shape here. If you can do <laughs> a couple of those chores, you'll be all right. And here are the chores that your parents left you, for you. First, we want you to take those plates and stack them. Bowl, plate, bowl, plate, bowl, plate. Then, plate, bowl, plate, bowl. 
Right, because it'd be too hard to do it the other way. So the plate is on the bottom, okay? Then after doing that, you want to take the milk from the cat dish there and pour it back into the milk container. Got that? Uh -huh. Then we want you to put the jello in the pretzel dish and the pretzels in the jello dish. And then after that, take this bird cage and put it in the television set, okay? Okay. All right. You're doing pretty well if you can get this. Ready? Think fast. Go. All right, let's give it a try. They've got a whole different kind of strategy going here. There's a bowl, there's a plate, there's another plate, and a bowl, and a plate, and a bowl, and a plate, and a bowl, and another plate, and a bowl. Yeah, that's a freestanding thing there. Okay, let's pour that cat stuff right back into the milk container. Very good. Yeah. Let's see if they can do this one here. Oh, time. oh, my goodness, just in time to make another mess. But, Gold, you won that one because you got two events finished. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Come on. Your parents are going to be very upset about this, though. But that's all right, because we're going to take an another look at today's Think Fast Brain Bender. Remember, it's a common object. We're going to show it to you for three seconds. Ready? Here's another clue. Any ideas? What is um, it? Dalmatians? Dalmatians. The gold team thinks Dalmatians. Is it Dalmatians? <laughs> no, not Dalmatians, but that's okay. Gold is leading 200 to blue 50, and that means we're going on to our next event. Come on. <laughs> Hi there. What we're going to do now is something very interesting. This one is called Bits and Pieces. What we're going to do is form words out of these bits and pieces of letters. Here's the question. What kind of animal was Mr. Ed? Mr. Ed. What was he? Come on, spell him out. Let's hear it. Go, go, go this way. Or go any way you want. Just get it done. Let's see what you got. Come on. Let's go. All right, the blue team has got something going here. What is it? I don't know. It's a little hard to see. Well, the gold team is doing very, very well. Yes, let's see what they got there. Yeah, yeah, gold. Wait a minute, what is that? Okay, I see, I see that's a lowercase r. H-O-R-S-E, of horse, of course, of course. Come on over here. You picked up another $100 and another shot at today's Think Fast Brain Bender. We're going to show it to you for three seconds. Remember, it's a photograph of a common object. Ready? Here is another clue. Michael, Anne Marie, any guesses? Soap, a bar of soap. A bar of soap, like you wash with, that kind of soap? Yeah. All right, is it a bar of soap? <laughs> yeah! Yeah, very good. Okay, that means the blue team has got 50, the gold has got 500, which means you're going to the locker room. Yeah! Yeah! Come on over, you two. You guys played... Oh, yeah, a little sportsmanship here going on. You played a great game, you guys, and you don't go home empty-handed. Matter of fact, we're going to let you go with $100 plus these great prizes. James. Justin and Becky, you'll take home three of the world's number one arcade hits by Taito for your Nintendo. Operation Wolf, Bubble Bobble, and Renegade. When you think games, think Taito, the only game in town. The incredible Franklin Spelling Ace makes spelling fast and fun with 80,000 words from Merriam-Webster. Franklin, world leader in handheld electronic reference products. And it's time to light up your room with Diana, our glowing neon wall clock. This hot timepiece makes any room explode with life. Made in the USA by Cecina. Michael? Thanks, James. Michael and Anne-Marie, you've played a great game, which means you're going on to the locker room. When we come back, we're going to make big matches for even bigger prizes. Stay tuned. Michael and Anne-Marie, this is what it all comes down to, the locker room. Yeah, you excited? Okay, because this is how we play it. There's something lurking behind each one of those locker doors. What you want to do is find six pairs that match. That's right, and when you make a match, you'll hear a bell. And when you hear that bell, you run down here and hit that button. That'll close all the doors, and then we'll show you your next match. 
Now, you've got 30 seconds to try, and each match you make, you get a prize. Now, you've already seen the wonderful prizes you get for the first three matches. James, tell them what they could win for the last three. Your very own yacht, Aristocrats, easy to build, state-of-the-art racing yacht, featuring sail control, nylon racing sails, aluminum mast, and two-channel Challenger radio only from Aristocrat. Check them out. Magna bikes with a power to climb and accelerate. Bikes for today. Why not try the next generation of bicycles? Magna, the hot new name on the street. And an exciting vacation. The Oasis Water Resort Villa Hotel. Just seconds from Palm Canyon Drive shopping. Plus ongoing admission to the Oasis Water Resort featuring California's largest wave action pool. Michael. Oh, there's one more thing I should mention. There's a time bomb in one of those lockers. Set to go off after 20 seconds. If you find it, we'll add 10 seconds to Michael's time. But if you miss it, we're going to subtract 10 seconds from Michael's time. You got that? Okay, then let's show her her first match. Oh, the bank robber. That's who you're looking for first, okay? okay. Let's put 30 seconds on the clock. Ready? Think fast. Where's that other bank robber? Where's that other bank robber? He's looking. Oh, it's not there. Where is he? Where is that other bank? She found the time bomb. Where's that other bank robber? There he is, a match, a match. Close them up, close them up. And let's see her next match, the waitress. Where's the other waitress? Where is that other waitress? There she is, another match. Come on back, close them up. All right, the confetti. Oh, time's up, very good. You got two matches though, and you find the time bomb. So Mike, come on in here. You got 40 seconds to find the remaining matches. You ready? ready? Let's show him his first match. There it is, the chef. We're gonna look for the chef. Ready? 40 seconds on the clock, think fast. He's off, where's that other chef? There's a match! Come on back, Mike, you got a match. Where's his next match? A clown, where's that other clown? No, there's a match, come on back. Where's his next match? Balls, where's that other ball thing? Yeah, that's it, another match. Come on back, show him his next match. A dentist with fruit. A dentist with fruit. Where's that other dentist? Where is that other dentist? Those have already been hit. Where's that other dentist? Where is he? There he is. Come on back. Come on back. Where's his next match? Oh, his time's up. Come on, over. What did they get all together, judges? They got everything. Yeah. All right. This is Michael Carrington saying, when well, you don't have time to think twice, think fast. Goodbye. Promotional consideration provided by Converse, home of the Converse Kids Collection, including all-stars and leather athletic shoes. From shooting hoops to hanging out, the Converse Kids Collection is all you need. The Ray-Ban Smart Start Collection from Bosch and Loam. They're what's happening in kids' fashion. Serious sunglasses for kids who want to look their coolest. Available in various styles and colors. And delicious Sunny Delight Florida Citrus Punch. Great taste for the whole family morning, noon, and night. Nothing delights you like Sunny Delight.